Alors le moustachu au cinéma et à la ville. Le Big Cutting Crew. La star montante du cinéma américain, Mickey Rourke. Well, with this thing, it's very weird. And I don't understand it. It's ugly. They say there's just enough religion in the world to make men hate one another, but not enough to make them love. Oh, is that what they say? I'll tell you something, Mr. Saifier, there uh, wasn't too much love around for Johnny Favorite. Mickey <laughs> Rourke. Avant de parler de vous, de votre personnalité, de votre façon de travailler, de ce que vous pensez de votre métier, de votre itinéraire, j'aimerais que vous me parliez un petit peu de cette, ce détective Harry Angel. Et d'abord, le film, est-ce que c'est un polar comme les autres ou est-ce que c'est un film fantastique ou est-ce que c'est les deux Tell me everything about Harry Angel. He, Harry Angel. Who is Harry Angel Is he the typical detective of the 50s uh, Yeah, Harry Angel. <laughs> Harry Angel is... Uh... A typical, like, uh, you know, knock around detective, kind of like a private, private, private eye. Mm -hmm. You know, and like a, he's like a, he's like a regular, regular guy. He's not like mm -hmm. very enthusiastic. He just wants to make a few dollars and, and he's like a regular, uh, he's pretty boring guy. Quand on vous a fait lire l'histoire, est-ce que vous avez accepté tout de suite When you read the script, you accept immediately No. Why Because the guy who gave me the script has been giving me scripts for years, El, uh, Elliot Kasner, and he gives me, brings me tons of shitty scripts. <laughs> so he brings me a script, he goes, here, great script. And then I said, well, you know... He, Then he says, Alan Parker is going to direct it. So I, I got a little excited. Uh, I read the script. I like what Alan did. I like Alan's movies. You know. Est-ce vrai qu'Alan Parker, le metteur en scène, a beaucoup hésité avant de travailler avec vous parce que vous avez la réputation d'être quelqu'un de pas très facile Bref, vous êtes, paraît-il, une grande gueule, quelqu'un de très capricieux. Est-ce que c'est vrai Is it true that Alan Parker was hesitating because you have a very strong image, a special image Is it true Yes. He yes. was uh, very nervous. Why Because uh, there was some stories about... Uh, Your image? Yeah. <laughs> What kind? No, just because when we did Nine and a Half Weeks, there was trouble. Yes. Because I wanted to make a movie that would sort of transcend anything that had to do with their in intimate relationship. I wanted to make a, a, a more uh, realistic movie about mm -hmm. two people where, like, you know, they're in the corner, yeah. you know, like, fucking or whatever and then kissing and then talking and they got scared they wanted to make it like a commercial yes vous pouvez nous parler un petit peu de, de la famille et de l'univers de votre enfance où avez-vous grandi et votre père votre mère les relations que vous aviez avec eux et avec vos, vos frères qui étaient je crois des demi-frères yeah. what souvenir what memory do you have of your childhood I left New York and grew up in Miami yeah with your mother with my mother yeah my brother and my sister Yes, it. <laughs> and my five stepbrothers. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't like Miami too much. No. No. And your childhood. Mm. Not very much. Mm. Not too much. Not too my much. Hands shaking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You start to talk about it. My hands gonna <laughs> start shaking. Quels sont les acteurs qui vous ont donné envie d'être un jour devant une caméra de cinéma? Rondo. <laughs> I never really wanted to be an actor, and, and really, it was yes. slowly. I just didn't know what I wanted to do. Uh, uh, after I stopped the boxing, I didn't really have a direction, so I drifted, and uh, mm -hmm. oh. and and, uh, and and I thought oh, I'll give it a try because I didn't, you know, I didn't know what I wanted to do. Est-ce que vous considérez qu'être comédien c'est un vrai métier? You like to be a star? Big nervous star. <laughs> yeah. But I think it's important to, you know, to uh, still keep that uh, sense of, of I, you know, I'm very fortunate to yeah. be in my position. Oh, I, okay. I have a lot of anger, let's say, at the, the way the critics treat 
certain directors and, and, and people, you know, especially myself, mm. you know, in, in the States. Instead, you get a whole bunch of, like, real plastic faggots that just sit there and they like to, you know, hear themselves talking about... Yeah. Revenons à ce film, j'ai lu également qu'Alan Parker euh, appréhendait votre rencontre avec Robert De Niro. Il paraît que vous observez un petit peu comme chien et chat. Est-ce que c'est vrai Was you very nervous before to, to see Bob De Niro um, I was not nervous. Acting doesn't make me nervous. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, acting is, you know... Maybe he was nervous, you know. Uh, I was excited because he has, you know, the reputation and he's done a lot of work. So I felt it was an honor for him to do, mm. to, you know, to be in the movie and to want to do it. And so it was exciting to work with, with Mr. De Niro. It really was. Thank you, Mr. Rourke. It was a pleasure to see you. You too. Thank you very much. On le retrouve aux côtés de Charlotte Rampling dans ce film d'Alan Parker, Art Angel, qui sort dans quelques jours.